Well, people are getting into the Halloween spirit already. According to the National Retail Federation's annual survey, Halloween participation is returning to pre-pandemic levels. But you might want to shop for candy early. That's if you have Halloween-themed favorites that you always like to hand out. I dig deeper into why this might be the case so you don't waste your money. We're a little over a month away from Halloween, but consumers are already hitting up the candy aisle to get stocked up for trick-or-treaters. What's your favorite candy? I would say chocolate, Hershey's with almond. Reese's. So how much candy do you typically buy? At least about 10 bags. And that demand, the Hershey Company understands well. In late July, Hershey's chairman and president and CEO Michelle Buck explained in prepared remarks, in part, seasonal consumer engagement is expected to remain high, and we expect high single-digit sales growth for both our Halloween and holiday seasons. Despite this strong growth, we will not be able to meet consumer demand due to capacity constraints. Major media outlets reported the news in July. I reached out to Hershey to ask if this means there will be a candy shortage. According to spokesperson Allison Kleinfelter, not at all. Just a shortage in Halloween packaging. Hershey's everyday and seasonal products are made on the same line. So Hershey's has to balance the making of everyday products like regular or king-sized candies with more seasonal portfolios like Reese's Pumpkins, Franken Cups, and more. So you order a lot of chocolate. Um, by our standards we do, by Hershey's standards or someone like that, we, we're, we're just really small. Douglas Kale, owner of Birmingham Chocolate, has dealt with supply chain issues. After the pandemic shut down, he ended up closing his Birmingham store, moving into a Ferndale warehouse and selling chocolates wholesale and online. He says some candy makers may be impacted by the war in Ukraine. If there's corn sweeteners or whatever, or dependent on Ukraine crops, then they've probably got a problem. As for Hershey's, a spokesperson says the company expects high sell-through rates and less limited time seasonal offerings within the final week of the holiday. You will still be able to find Reese's, Kit Kat, Hershey's, and the like. They'll just be in everyday packages, not the fun Halloween wrappers. Bottom line, there is no candy shortage, but some of your favorite Halloween themed packages or small sizes may sell out before Halloween. So if you decide to buy a bunch of candy bags early, Douglas Kale at Birmingham Chocolate says there are three pointers to remember. One, keep your candy at room temperature. Two, keep your candy out of direct sunlight. You don't want it melting. And three, don't move candy in and out of the refrigerator because that could actually cause a bloom issue and Kale says that you do not need to freeze candy unless it has a cream center or fruits and nuts in it, that kind of thing. So for the most part, uh, you can buy your candy early. It'll be just fine. Okay.